Hi, boys and girls. This is Curious Cutie. Welcome to the Storybook Club. We are not performing today, but, well, we sort of are. We are about to tell a story, um, and it's going to be all made up. Now, I'm about to explain to everyone how to play, including you, but before we do that, we have been getting a lot of comments asking how many Elwell dolls we have. Now, for some of the episodes on our channel, there's going to be a different amount of LOL dolls, but in LOL dolls families, um, we're going to count how many of us are there. I don't even know. All I know is there's at least one, which is me. <laughs> so let's start with one, and then I'm going to keep counting, and feel free to join. One, two, three, four, five, sorry, Posh, six, seven, eight, sorry, nine, ten, <laughs> now it gets hard. 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18! There are 18 LOL Dolls in LOL Dolls Family Club. That is so cool! Well, welcome to LOL Dolls Families. <laughs> and, oh, that didn't even include the LOL Little Sisters or pets. So we're going to have to uh, count those another day. <laughs> But anyways, back to today, we are going to play a super fun game, and all 18 of us are going to contribute to a story. Now, um, each of us are going to say one sentence, and by the end, it's going to create a whole story, which we will then perform, maybe, if it's good enough, in another video. <laughs> so, boys and girls, maybe you decide if the story is worth it. Um, you know, getting it published, putting it out there, and it's really cool that you get to watch us create it. Also, you guys should play this game with your friends and family because it's really fun. It's a fun game to do in the car, if it's a long car ride, or if you just wanted something to do on a rainy day, something like that, or just whatever. So anyways, I'm going to start it, and we're going to start with, oh, Yang Cutie down there. Hello. Here we go. Okay, everyone ready? Let's do this. Oh. Once upon a time, there was a princess. The princess was very, very nice, but whenever she tried to sing, she sounded like a toad. She told her mom and dad that when she grew up, she wanted to be a famous singer. And when she sang for them, all they heard was, Oh, ribbit, ribbit, <laughs> ribbit. She soon realized that she could never be a performer or a singer because of her strange froggy voice. So she decided to ask her other princess friend, Cinderella, for advice. Cinderella didn't really know what to do, but she said, Do you have a fairy godmother? But the princess didn't know if she had a fairy godmother or not, so she went on a quest to search for her. She decided to go to the nearest village and look around to see if anyone knew of a fairy godmother around the village. She met a lot of people in the village, but none of them could help her. She made some friends along the way. Oh, sorry, that was more than one sentence. Oh, the continue. Sorry, dull face. Don't worry, I got you. She made some friends along the way. How was that? Perfect. Even though her friends were very supportive, um, they could not help her find a fairy godmother or figure out why she sounded like a frog when she tried to sing. So then she said, well, Cinderella wasn't very much help because, well, she has a fairy godmother and I obviously don't, so I'm going to go to Ariel to ask for help. She seems to know a lot about voices. Ariel suggested that maybe Ursula the sea witch took her voice when she was little without her knowing and cast a spell on her so that she would sound like a frog. So then um, the princess decided to go underwater with Ariel and see if they could find Ursula so that maybe they could get her to give her voice back. But when they found Ursula, it was really bad because uh, Ursula was like, hey, uh, I um, actually can uh, give you your voice back, but I'm keeping Ariel here forever. Ha 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 ha! So then the princess, um, the princess realized she had made a mistake, and and she tried to get Ariel back, but Ariel couldn't, and she was stuck there with Ursula. 
Then the princess decided to go back home to see if she could do something to help Ariel. But she, when she got home, all she did was sit down and cry and cry. She was just sitting on her bench outside and looking up at the night sky when she then wished upon a star for Ariel to be okay. But as soon as she made the wish, something amazing happened. A fairy godmother appeared. Oh well, everyone, well, we got through all 18 of us. But I don't think that story is over yet. Boys and girls, do you think we should continue? Um, well, I think we should. Okay, chapter two. Oh, the fairy godmother, she cried, and um, she, she said, I need your help. So her and the fairy godmother um, flew over to the ocean to find Ariel. When they got into the ocean, um, the princess uh, got Ariel out, and the fairy godmother and the witch had a big fight. The fairy godmother and Ursula um, kept fighting until eventually... The fairy godmother won and defeated Ursula. The princess thanked her fairy godmother over and over again and um, took Ariel to safety. The fairy godmother told the princess that she arrived at her wish because she was wishing for somebody else instead of herself. And that was a very selfless and beautiful thing. The fairy godmother left, but then Ariel and the princess decided to get tea with Cinderella. The three girls were at the tea party singing their favorite uh, Disney princess songs when the princess realized something. She completely forgot about her original wish to be able to sing. And then for the first time in her whole life, she sang the most beautiful, sweet song anyone had ever heard to her two best princess friends. The princess realized she was the happiest she had ever been in her whole life and went home to her mother and father to sing them a song too. And then the princess's dreams came true after all. She became a famous singer and she loved her life. Yeah, I think we should wrap it up there. The end! Hello, boys and girls! I think that was a really great story. I think that's something we could perform for you if you'd like. Oh, goodness, that's going to be amazing. Well, um, I guess you should stay tuned uh, for another video where we, where we use that story because it was really, really good. <laughs> Hooray! Okay, everyone, we officially wrote our first story. This is so exciting. So now we need to make it a musical, don't we? So let's add some really fun songs. How about this? Everyone... Think of a song, write it right now. This will be the song that the princess sings at the end, and then we'll decide who has the best song idea. Now, I won't participate because I want you guys to be able to do this since I'm the head of the storybook club. Well, really, this could be a good thing for the pop club or the uh, glee club um, with with singing and, and songwriting, but um, it goes with our story, so. Okay, let's do this! Starting with... Oh, 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 I got it, I got it, I got it. It's, it's, it's Yang Cutie. <laughs> okay, here it is, here it is, ready? Uh -uh. I used to sing like a frog, but then I walked through the fog, and now I sing anything, and I love it, and I love singing. That's it. Thank you. Nice one! Okay, my turn, my turn! <coughs> I like to sing a uh, about the moon and the June and the spring uh, I like to sing a uh, about a sky of blue Hey, 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 that's a real song. You had to write a song. Oh, I thought maybe you wouldn't notice. Ugh. Oh, goodness. Okie dokie, here we go. <clears throat> Do you ever feel like a frog princess? Drifting through the wind, wanting to start again. Do you ever feel like a plastic bag? Sorry, uh, I don't know this song. Um, hold on, let me just get to the refrain. It's not quite done yet. <clears throat> Cause baby, you're a princess. Come on, let your voice sing. Make it go, ribbit, ribbit, ribbit. <laughs> as, we, as we leap across the room, room, room. Oh wait, but she's not a frog anymore at this point. Okay, I need some more time, sorry. Okay, here we go. <laughs> I 
Hi, hi, hi. I got me a voice and I thought you'd like it. Sometimes I like to eat Ikes and Mikes it. Then I like to sit and then I like to look out the window. How's that? Oh, that was so sweet, you just said. All right, here we go. I am the singing princess because my dreams came true. And if it weren't for my fairy godmother, I could never sing with you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Cool, that was really cool. Okay, um, here's my, here's mine. Um, look out world, cause I can sing. I can sing almost anything. I just go, oh, I just go, oh, oh, oh. Hear my voice. How is that? Good, thanks. Hey, now I can sing and I used to only rib it. Look out world, cause I'm about to sing it. Hey singer, do, 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 do. Hey singer, do, 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 do. I'm a princess, princess that I am. Now you're gonna want me in your band, cause I'm a singer. I'm a singer. We defeated that witch with all our might. Now I wished on a star that burned real bright, cause I'm a singer. I'm a singer. I'm a singer. Oh, well, that was really pretty, MC Swag. Not really singing, though, but uh -uh. let's see here. Um, how does it begin? Okay, okay. <clears throat> Friends singing while we're drinking tea. I can't believe it's me right now. Because I'm singing, I've never sang before. Thank you, thank you. Oh, I didn't have words, but that's pretty much how it's gonna go. Shoop up, shoop up, up, shoop up, shoop up, up. Now that I can sing, my darling. Give me a ring now that I can sing. I'll do anything for you. Shoop up, shoop up, up, shoop up, shoop up, up. I can sing, I can sing for you, my love. Shoop up, shoop up, up, shoop up, shoop up, up. I'm like a pretty white dove. Thank you. What is this I'm hearing? Is it really my song? I can't believe my ears. I finally found my voice. And it's singing and it's my choice. I looked inside. I sing my song. I'll sing it now. It'll take real long to know where my life will go. My dreams have come true. I've never sang like this before. And once I can do it, I'll never do it anymore. No, that's not how it goes. I've just noticed something. I haven't thought about my wish As I drink my tea and set it down on this beautiful princess dish Jazz, I mean not Jasmine uh, Cinderella and Ariel Get ready to hear me sing Cause it's wonderful, we're all here now Drinking tea and everything Thank you That witch was a ninny But guess what? That witch was a meanie, and I kicked her in the butt. What? Uh, uh. I used to croak just like a toad, but I just drove down a crazy road, and I'm here, and I'm singing so clear. Everyone, the day is done, and all we can do now is have some fun singing. Who saw 
Like you the best. And um, while we while we're thinking about it, we'll go ahead and do the shout out of the day. The shout out of the day goes out to Shiloh, who says she's the biggest Georgia Chihuahua fan. Oh, we love her too. Thank you so much for commenting. And um, boys and girls, remember if you comment, you may be featured in one of our future videos, just like uh, Shiloh. So thank you so much, Shiloh. Um, okay. So everyone, I have a very special announcement to make. The winner of our songwriting contest is Sugar Queen! Yay! Oh, oh, thank you! Thank you so much! Oh! Yes, but guess what else? What? We aren't just gonna use your song. We're gonna use most of your song and a little bit of everyone else's. Oh boy! That's gonna be really fun and a lot of work and we're all gonna do it. Now we have to start thinking about a title as well. I think I have one in mind, but uh, anyone else have some ideas? Ooh, ooh, how about, oh, sorry. How about Wish Upon a Star? How about the Toad Princess? Uh. Oh, 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 I know. The Princess and the Witch. Um, I know. How about, um, Hey Princess? Oh, it could be something like maybe the magic wish. Or maybe maybe the princess who couldn't sing. Oh, oh, a Disney princess musical. Okay, you guys, guys, you guys, listen, I have it. It's perfect, it's perfect, okay? Listen. The princess who didn't have a voice, so that, so she went on a quest to see if she could find a fairy godmother, but then she couldn't find a fairy godmother, so she went um, actually to Ariel uh, because she thought maybe Ariel could help her, and then Ariel brought it to the sea witch, and then the the, 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 the the sea witch took Ariel, and then and then the prince is crying, and then the fairy godmother came. We know that was the whole story. Sorry. What about pretty pretty princess? Oh oh oh! Princess at Tiffany's. The princess who learned a lesson. The singing princess. The brave princess. The pop star princess. Wow, these are all really, really great ideas. Boys and girls, please put in the comments what you think the title of the musical should be called. Um, hmm, here's my idea. <clears throat> I think someone might have said it already. The princess who, could, who couldn't sing? Um, I don't know if we're gonna stick with it because I don't know if it's, it's, if it's creative enough, but uh, that's an idea. I guess we'll find out in our next video uh, what um, we should call the title of this musical. Anything else we need to plan out? Yeah, who's playing who? I'm assuming I'm the king. Oh, uh, I want to be the princess. I want to be Cinderella. Oh, oh, can I play the fairy godmother? Can I be Ariel? <laughs> okay, okay, we are going to have to hold auditions for this, so I can't tell you, tell anyone who they're gonna play yet. But let me know um, who you guys want to play once we get to auditions, and I will take it in consideration, I will be playing the narrator, as usual. <laughs> Boys and girls, I hope you are so, so excited to see our original musical, The Princess Who Couldn't Sing. At least, well, that's the title for now. Um, and uh, please check out our other musicals on our channel. Um, we have a lot. We also have lots of Disney princess videos, Play-Doh. Oh, that's another thing. Who wants to do costumes? I, I would like to, I'll volunteer. Oh, oh okay. thank you, Luce, baby. Oh, she's really good at that. Anyways, like I was saying, please check out our other musicals and please put in the comments um, uh, what other musicals you would like us to do that you haven't seen yet. Somebody recently requested The Sound of Music, which is amazing because one of my dream roles is to play Maria. The hills are alive with the sound of music. Ah. <laughs> With songs they have sung for a thousand years The hills fill my heart With the sound of music And I'll sing once more Please don't! Sorry about that, we will not be casting Teacher's Pet as Maria Great job! Okay, anyways, boys and girls, 
Have a wonderful afternoon. We really hope you enjoy this video and stay tuned for our original musical. Have a wonderful night, day, morning, whatever it is. Goodbye! If you liked this video and would like to see more like it, please subscribe and hit the like button below. Thank you so much, everyone.